Hey y'all and welcome to Vlogmas Day 6. Today we're going to make some compostable ornaments that are outdoor tree friendly so you don't worry about getting microplastics or plastic or anything in the environment. Excited about that? We've got to go to the store to pick up some stuff and then we're going to come back and we're going to make all the ornaments. Wait, this is no, so these are not real. I want real ones. Where are the real ones? Oh wow, this is I've never seen. I kind of like that. Like it's it's weird. Like the lights are really small. I do I like it. I kind of dig that. <sighs> what the big big tree? The big big colorful. <laughs> because Texas. Oh look at the squirrel. Huh. He's so short. <laughs> like cactus. Are these real? I don't think so. I think they might have the real ones by the front. Well, I was going to say outside. Or outside, like, yeah. Because that's where they actually do it. Uh, yeah. Look. Do, do. Are they real? I think these no, these are still the fake ones. Is this big enough? Is this good? Ooh, these plants are really cute. They have yellow places. I think we're gonna get another one, but like a little one. I don't know where we're gonna put it yet, but maybe on the bookshelf? Because there's like an empty spot on the bookshelf right now. Yeah. Bird feeders, but we need bird seed. Birds blend? Birders blend, select blend. Just corn. <laughs> corn for the squirrels. Just dried ears of corn. Wild birds? Great for year round. Attracts a wild, wide variety of birds, most colorful songbirds. So I think we should go with the wide variety of birds. Yes. There's enough? Yeah, there's plenty. Okay. Okay, now we must find, we must find flower seeds for flower bombs. Party tree up there. I like this. I like the colors. We can't find flower seeds. I'm so upset. I can't make flower bombs if we can't find flower seeds. Okay, so seeds are out of season. So they didn't have flower seeds or any other type of seeds that weren't grass or bird seeds. So don't know that we're gonna be able to make seed bombs. That's okay. We will still go with all of the other ornaments that we want to make. We have to stop at Whole Foods so that we can get some oranges. So we can make dried orange slices and uh, see if they have seeds. I doubt they will because we're going to the really tiny Whole Foods, but we'll try. We'll see. We'll look. Christmas lights! <laughs> Hold on, yet. While we were in Home Depot, it started raining. Now we're at Whole Foods to grab a couple of things. And they have Christmas lights up! Oranges required. I'm just saying we, had, we, we acquired the oranges, that's all. Oranges, check! Yeah. Okay. I was gonna get candy canes on Monday, but like we're already here. Should I go ahead and get them to put them on the tree? Do it! Are these... They are, look, labeled vegan. I fucking love Whole Foods so much. Yes! Dude, I don't think we need two boxes. Okay. Because I don't really eat a lot of them. I just like to have them on the tree. 
I was just gonna say it's a big tree and I wanna spread them out. So we just finished at Whole Foods and and it's actually about dinner time. It's about 5.15, 5.20. So I'm gonna order Ike's and we're gonna go pick it up before we go home. That way we can go ahead and eat dinner and then we can make the ornaments because he wants a hot sandwich. Hot sandwich. It's cold and rainy, so a hot sandwich does sound good. Oh, it's already dark. I hate having a weak stomach. Like, I feel slightly nauseous right now, and I don't know if it's... Sometimes I get car sick a little bit, so I'm hoping that that's all it is, and once we get home and I eat some food, my stomach will settle, but like, ugh, it's the worst. Feeling nauseous is the worst. The worst. Mm, it makes me feel tired and gross. I'm also thinking that maybe it was because I drank a prebiotic drink at the same time that I was drinking coffee, which probably is not the best idea. But I didn't think of that. Now I feel like crap. We made it home. He's trying to figure out how to work the air fryer. You definitely don't want the oranges sitting back here because it's going to blow hot air. Um, because we picked up some french fries and some onion rings to have with our sandwiches while we were at the store. I think you figured it out. Ah, probably gonna eat our sandwiches. Yeah, while well, their fries are going. But I'm gonna go ahead and hang these on the tree. Um, so I'm just gonna throw it out there. Feel free to shoot it down. First Lord of the Rings. How is that a Christmas movie? It just feels so festively. Also, it was released around Christmas time. Just okay. Lord of the Rings is not a Christmas movie, and I also don't enjoy them. Boo. What Christmas movie are we gonna watch? We're gonna find out. We're gonna look at the or are we gonna watch Owl House? We can watch Owl until House. Until we make ornaments later. I was trying to hop into the holidays, explore the content, details. Oh, dang. Happiest season of the Minions? Movie has David. I've never seen the Minions holiday special. Because it's Minions holiday special. I think we should watch that. Um, How long is it? Um, 21 minutes. See, it's not that long. Food time! <laughs> Yo, okay, this place has a vegan meatball sub. It's amazing. It's already getting late, but that's okay. We have the fruit in the oven. That's gonna take quite a while because it's really low, but that's okay. 
We're about to make the bird feeder ornaments. All the recipes that I found use gelatin, but of course, we're not using gelatin. We're gonna use agar. Basically, it's just like agar and bird seeds pressed into these cookie cutters. Yee. And then I'm also gonna use this metal straw to cut out the circle that we string the string through. Okay, so what we do is we cook the water and the agar together and then we mix the seeds in. And then we press the seeds into the cookie cutters and then they harden and then we remove the cookie cutters and then they are the shape. I'm supposed to spray these so that these seeds come out easier. Hey Siri, add nonstick spray to the grocery list. Wait, I put it there. And then, it's sliding again. Why do you do this to me? Usually it's only the last layer that does it. Like if I extend all the way here, it's this layer that does it. Okay, but if I, if I only extend that, that, okay, so then I do this, and then I do that, and then now it's good. It's just that bottom one. Aww. I don't know why. I'm really hoping they stick together, but they do seem to be doing all right. Like I can pick one up and like hold it, which is cool. So we have all of our bird seed ornaments. Now there's bird seed all over my kitchen. We have a little bit left, so I don't know, maybe we'll just like sprinkle it around the tree or something, but we really need to get to the popcorn garland. Do I need to like spray this with water or something to make it like, not fall apart when I put a string through it. I don't know, I've never made popcorn garland. Wish me luck. Let's check on these guys. Apples coming along. Oh, the oven smells so good. Stick your face in the oven, it smells so good. We've done all of this popcorn and also gotten popcorn all over the couch. And it is really late. So I'm gonna end this vlog here. We're just gonna finish stringing popcorn and then go to bed. The fruit is still drying out, but it's just dried fruit. I'll show you it tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell and like this video if you liked it. I'm gonna have little how-tos and recipes down below on how you can make these compostable ornaments. And I will see y'all tomorrow.